Love it, love it. That is a, that's a top <laughs> quality Miko tip. Haven't forgotten. Haven't forgotten. <laughs> So, um, welcome to Unitunes backstage. Uh, we're incredibly lucky to be interviewing Tiger Lily. You just performed. It was tremendous. We had a great dance. Uh, how do you feel? Very sweaty, um, but very happy. I had so much fun. I wasn't sure what to expect on a Thursday night. It's pretty cold in Sydney at the moment, but that was mental. And everyone just wants to rave. So, we did that for an hour, hence my sweat. <laughs> You're like an international artist. Everyone you know, around the world loves you, uh, including us in Australia. Um, how, like, what does that compare, like going to a Sydney uh, party compared to like somewhere elsewhere in the world? So I always think like Sydney being my hometown is the best. It obviously holds a very special place in my heart, especially a uni that I actually studied at myself. So it's pretty special coming back here and playing. Um, I will say the Australian crowds are definitely more crazy and we'll definitely be doing shoeys on the dance floor, getting up on each other's shoulders. Maybe not so much as the European crowds, they may be a little more put together, but we like the crazy. Love it. Uh, so you went to UCID. Could you tell us a little bit about what you studied and how that helped you when you left, us, left the uni gates? Yeah, so my first year at uni here, I was in science because my goal was to be a dentist. And after doing 12 months of science here, I was like, this is a really bad decision. Why did I ever do this? This is wrong for me, obviously. And then I went and did media and communications. Um, was pretty, yeah, <laughs> lucky that I kind of like fell into that and really enjoyed it. And it aligned with, I suppose, my personality a lot more than dentistry. Go team, figuring out what we want to do. Um, and yeah, I did a, a double major of marketing and sociology. Don't know if the sociology helped, but the marketing definitely has been pretty helpful. Um, and I think the best thing I learned from uni was how to be diligent with my time management because I was working a lot as a DJ when I was at uni um, and you know managing a workload and a study load was pretty a pretty tricky skill to learn, but very important. You looked like you were having a lot of fun up there, such as literally climbing on the table. That was amazing. Um, how much do you think, um, oh goodness, I'm blanking on my question now, that's bad. <laughs> um, Finn can edit it out in post. Yeah. <laughs> Miko. Um, yeah, how, how much do you think that that is part of the Tiger Lily brand? Like 100%. It's all about fun. It's all about, you know, being yourself, getting everyone to sing along to songs they know. My thing is I want people on the dance floor to have as much fun as I'm having. And I know what I want to hear at parties and I know what me and my girlfriends want to do on the dance floor. So I just try and really emulate that. And yeah, it's all about being yourself, having fun, not being too worried about what other people think of you and having a go. Love it. So behind it, when you're not behind the DJ deck, you're a little bit of a health icon. Uh, what is your recommendation to uni students to keeping you know, that balanced lifestyle and how important is raving to part of that? So when I was in uni, I was not healthy at all. I think I would eat just up and goes and that's it, like, and coffee and that was it. <laughs> um, I'm a big fan of a green smoothie and anything smoothie, throw all the fruit and vegetables um, into the blender because I feel like it's the perfect nutritious go-to snack and you know, it's quick, it's easy, it's really, really healthy. What was the second part of the question? How important is raving to the balanced lifestyle? Raving? Oh my God, so important. You have to have your yin and your yang. So, you know, your chilled time and then your crazy time. And if you love dancing and love partying, then it's really important to, you know, have fun social times, doing what you love, not just chilling and being healthy all the time. All right, well, we won't keep you uh, all night, but thank you so much for talking to us. We really appreciated it. Uh, it's great to have you back where you studied, and we, uh, yeah, we hope you have a great night. This has been... Thank you. Thank Sorry, you. I interrupted. <laughs> no worries. This has been Unitunes Backstage. <laughs> thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you for listening to Unitunes.